Salam brothers and sisters Bessama Ab World World Where Memphis Kudus Ahadu Amlak Igzabi Yemeskin It gives me great pleasure to talk about Lij Iyasu and the metaphysical connection with Esau. One of the metaphysical connections are the fact that Esau married two Ishmaelite women, Ishmael representing Islam and Lij Iyasu converted to Islam. In the Book of Jubilees, Isaac, the father of Jacob and Esau, said he first loved Esau more than Jacob because he was born first. This shows that Isaac, who is meant to represent the spiritual seed, the Christian seed, had a carnal mentality towards his relationship with Esau and Jacob. The princes, the nobles and the ministers sent a message to Nagus Mikael, the father of Lij Iyasu. You the king know that all the work which your son Lij Iyasu has accomplished from the time he became crown prince up to the present was childish behaviour. When we meant to train him with the reproachful counsel, we did not find the occasion because to our chagrin he never stayed long enough in one place. When at times we managed to find him and tender advice, he would not accept our view. When we watched him patiently, lest his personality should feel offended, thinking that perhaps one day soon he would become aware of his government's needs and of his own rank and honour, and perhaps abandon his useful pursuits. Yet he had still not had enough of these perulia and began striving to establish Islam in our country Ethiopia, which had lived steadfast in her Christianity for some 1,600 years since Abriha and Ashiba and Salama, the revealer of the light. When in the previous year he came to Walo, you, O King, know yourself all the things he did together with the Muslims during the rainy season. Again, we have heard of your angry counsel to Lich Iyasu when you recognised that his heart had become alienated from the Christian faith and said to him, I beg you, my son, abandon this plan of yours. Yet even you, O king, did not prevail. And now we are sending you, together with this letter, photographs of him which prove all the things he has been doing jointly with the Muslims when he went down to Harar secretly without informing us. We have suffered all this patiently, but when all of us together, including the Archbishop and the Etchad, sent him a letter requesting him to come to Addis Ababa, at any rate for the New Year celebration, he persisted in not coming. Our anxiety in acting in this manner arise from the thought lest the Christian faith be extinguished and for this reason the blood of the Christians be shed in vain and our country pass into the hands of foreigners. May the king thus be very mindful of this matter. It is known that the people would not have risen up unless they had been certain of this. Moreover, we will remind you of the extinction of your name as well for it is bound to remain recorded in history for, the, for future generations. Because of Lij Iyasu, Nagus Mikhail's son, the Christian religion was eclipsed in Ethiopia and Islamic faith expanded. In writing all this to the king, it is not that we have acted thus with the intention that Lij Iyasu be harmed or in particular that the king be antagonized, but it is with the thought that we should act jointly for what is of the benefit to our religion and to our government. Your plans do not diverge from us, for we know that you love Emperor Manelik and all of us and are much concerned for the Christian faith. More about Lij Iyasu's character. While in doing all this, he was aware of everybody's hostility and instead of watching things by being in one place, he did a great deal of roaming about, joyfully invading tranquil provinces and killing people. Sometime going to Gimilra, another to Wallo, yet another to Adol country, and sometimes to Hara. The blood of many was flowing, 
When he returned from his trips, the nobles and ministers tendering advice and getting angry, all despaired when they realised their inability to restore his mind to sanity. There were, however, some who advised him as follows. If the honour of the great nobles of Menelik's time were reduced and their rank diminished, then it would be convenient for you to raise to office the humble. It would assuredly result from this that these minor figures will respectively love you alone. And with this support you will be able to act as you wish and to destroy your enemies. As this appeared to him to be true, he began to strive to bring this about. But just to remind the listeners, all things are for the Creator's purpose. And to remember that both Ishmael and Isaac, natural and spiritual seed of Abraham or Ibrahim, will be rewarded by the Most High Ixiabye.